You're watching the book reviewer with Cindy Brady, where we make hardcovers soft. Hello, and welcome back to another episode of the book reviewer with your host Cindy. And I don't have a book review to share with you, you guys. So I'm going to talk a little bit about um, me being just a little bit distracted. And I'm going to tell you about some pending book reviews that you will see in the coming weeks and, and possibly months. I only kind of do this from week to week, so maybe just week to week. Um, so I've been a little bit distracted this past few days. Um, most of you in the U.S. and possibly the world have heard about Hurricane Harvey and the devastation that it's caused people's houses have been destroyed um, it's just a lot of damage things like that and um, Houston has been badly badly hit um, it's going to take quite a while for them to rebuild get back to their homes you guys have seen the footage the immense flooding um, all of that um, what some people don't know is that it affected us in San Antonio as well, um, which is where I live. Um, so s last Friday was the 25th and the 26th, that Friday and Saturday of August. Um, so it wasn't that long ago. Um, we were purported to, not purported, but... Um, expected to get a huge amount of rain. The meteorologists forecast about 10 to 20 inches of rain, which is about two or three years of rainfall for our area. And this was quite a bit of rain um, that was forecast. And so Friday and Saturday is sort of when we get our errands done. Um, we need we had to get so much needed food, we needed to do this, that, and the other. And you know how errands go. Sometimes they take a long time, sometimes they don't. And we were able to get what they, what we needed to done. Um, but we were prepared to get that amount of rain. Um, if we, if, if it turned out the way the meteorologist had said. Um, fortunately, we didn't get that much rain. It was probably about 7 to 10 inches, nowhere near what was projected for that time period. So it was like a weekend. It did, um, Hurricane Harvey did affect us just a little bit. There were some meetings that were canceled for our church and some services like trash pickup and recycling were affected, um, but not that much. Um, I was wondering some if my son was going to be able to go to school this past Monday, and he was able to. So I've been following Hurricane Harvey very closely, and that's gotten me a little distracted because this is a main event. This is something that you don't want to be a part of um, but you can be as involved as you can to see what the latest is and what people are doing and what things are happening over there to stay kind of up to the minute to know what's happening and how you can help um, so that that hit close to home for me and thankfully it was in our area although I know in San Antonio there are a few low water crossings but not that many I think we would have been okay if we had the 20 inches of rain or whatever they said that we would get fortunately it wasn't that much but um, I, I feel for Houston I really do some people have lost everything. Um, sometimes 
you know, because water can do a lot of damage and and that's not fun. Um, so with that out of the way, um, I don't really want to talk about that a lot, but um, so I have some pending book reviews. I had started to read um, one of the books that I got for free or nearly free um, and I realized it was a mystery book too. Now reading books out of order makes as much sense as reading the first page and the last page of any book that you've read because you get the once upon a time and then the happily ever after but you don't know the stuff in the middle so I thought well I'll just switch to something else and I started reading another book last night um, if you'll remember last week I put up a video I'll put a link up right hand corner so you guys can see it um, it was another Beverly Lewis book it was a Beverly Lewis book it was called The Covenant and there is a five books I believe in the series and I have started reading book number two and um, for those who don't know, this um, this Abrams Daughters um, series is a five book series about these four um, Mennonite Amish family that grows up and um, they're very religious so that plays a part there um, and well just just go to the link in the description, the the cards. So um, I explain it kind of there. Anyway, so yesterday didn't work to record this video, partially because it was really late, and I was like, I can I can do a video a video tomorrow and see how that works. Um, I've done videos on Thursdays before. Um, I might even think about doing Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday videos, but that is still in the works. So, um, if you, if you liked what you saw, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Like this video and share it with your friends to help us grow the audience. As always, thanks for watching. Thanks for subscribing. Keep reading, don't stop believing, and we will see you again next week. Bye!